on your mark. Next event on the track is our third time final for the under 10, under 11 girls, my apologies. So from lane one, Geelong, two, Cranbourne B, three, Diamond Valley, four, Keelor, five, Caulfield, six, Berwick, seven, Whittlesea City, and in lane eight, Cranbourne. Set. Nice clean start for the athletes here. Probably my pick of the bunch might have been that of the athletes from Caulfield and Berwick. Those two out in five and six. Probably expect them to tussle it out. So it is Berwick that are going to take the baton first. Beautiful change in actual fact. Caulfield clo uh, followed closely behind. Diamond Valley running very strong on the back straight leg as well. The athlete there in lane three. But it is Berwick out in front at the moment running really well. Let's see how this change goes. Very clean once again. The athlete from Caulfield just positions the baton just a little bit more in her hand, preparing herself for the final change coming into the front straight. Diamond Valley moving up, as is Keelor as well. So let's see who takes the baton first. It is going to be Keelor taking it first. Berwick also, Keelor and Diamond Valley. Those four teams, keep an eye on those. They're going to really battle it out to the finish. The athlete from Caulfield running very well at the moment. She's going to take this across the line first, just in front of Berwick. Keelor, Diamond Valley, Cranbourne, Geelong, Cranbourne and Whittlesea City.